and here we are out of the box as you can see it comes in this nice hard case with their logo on the top feels like um, aluminum I think it is but you know plenty good typical camera case you know any protective case foam egg crate foam on the inside um, looks like we got a a wipe here to clean the lens more than likely um, like it's got a partition divider between the tripod and then the scope itself is right here It looks like it comes with a strap. Uh, it's like a a foam, a thin foam, with around a piece of uh, card board. Get some keys for the case. The moisture removing crap. A little the foam. It's like a manual spotting scope manual. Seems to be a nice case. Looks like if you remove the foam, let's see. Yep, yeah, it's a divider. It's a divider in these grooves in here with the foam there's the cloth carrying case which is kind of cool looks like you could probably use that for carrying anything else I mean it's got a shoulder strap inside just typical cloth case it's got a velcro like the divider looks like maybe you could put the uh, the, uh, um, the scope in one section and then the tripod in another to divide the two um, aside from that the components unboxed nice case. I imagine you could probably arrange it with some other pieces of foam to carry the scope, the tripod, and maybe even additional things, you know, out to the range. Alright, so there's the tripod. Um, it seems to be made out of fairly thin metal. That's, uh, the legs are a square-shaped U kind of stamped out legs fold out like any normal tripod is got rotational adjustments for up and down and, you know seems to be not a bad little tripod um, for something that comes with it here's the scope itself unwrapped seems to be made of kind of a rubber coated shell I've heard some complaints about one of the models splitting angled ones is made out of this uh, this two piece kind of rubberized plastic uh, I could see maybe where that would separate on some of the other ones, but this one obviously didn't come separated and looks like it's it's made fairly tough. 
at the base where it mounts to any standard tripod mount. These protective uh, lens covers here made out of just plastic. Be a fair, fairly for the money, a fairly high quality scope. There it is on the stand. Uh, the tripod seems to be not a bad little tripod. Twist this to tighten or loosen. Loosen it up and then twist it to tighten it. On the bottom where it mounts you can see there's uh, two pieces of rubber that come together where you screw see there's two pieces of rubber there on each the stand and the scope provide probably extra cushioning and dampening the covers screw off the rear one screws off which is kinda cool it's just a plastic lens cover and there you can see if you can see the threads There's some threads right here where this, uh, this cover screws in. The front one just pops off. But I'm probably see maybe the threads being a good idea for sure. Might be able to get another cover. Who knows what. I imagine somebody out there can think of something to do with those threads to add some versatility to it. But that's pretty much the spotting scope. I'm gonna go see, uh, check out clarity and a uh, field of view. Quality and field of view. I went ahead and pushed the camera up against the eyepiece and snapped some pictures. So we're not gonna have an exact representation considering lighting and the fact that the lens isn't exactly like the eye up against the uh, you know the eyepiece of the spotting scope but this should be a fairly close representation